Devangles College is the lighthouse of the Berea. Let's stop for a moment and turn the spotlight on our junior primary. We invite you to listen to our stories and to experience the true essence of our 21st century curriculum. DGC is a Christian school, and whilst not a church school, which means we don't have a chapel on site, we do, however, have a full-time chaplain, and are very proud of our strong Christian heritage. Girls attend special services throughout the year, and from grade double naught to grade eight, attend religious education classes with me. These classes are compulsory, but they are never for assessment, which means no homework or tests or report comments for RE. We enjoy a very diverse student body here at college, which makes for robust discussion in a safe space where we can learn to communicate with one another with respect. We chose Durban Girls College for her because firstly we want a school that offers um, academic excellence and through our research we realized that this would definitely be the school where the teaching method is um, very modern, innovative, uses current technology but also still mixes that with um, your traditional teaching methods. So um, we can see already that her thinking has changed, she gets a chance to be very creative um, and really the possibilities are endless for her academically. We want to create a global citizen out of her um, and uh, we see that this school has got a lot of international links so she'll be able to get opportunities to also create her own international opportunities because the world is getting smaller. Um, also sports wise she gets a lot of exposure, a lot of opportunities. Um, she's able to choose for herself what interests she has. So we think the school nurtures um, their talent sports wise as well. Um, and because of the wide variety, she'll be able to really play any sports that she wants to. The college is a school that constantly reinvigorates itself to make itself relevant to successive generations. So these beautiful, crisp new teaching spaces and the exciting methods of teaching take place within a context of a long and proud history and traditions of which the old girls are so proud. What pleases me hugely is that the basic tenets of common sense, courtesy and consideration for others that I learned here as a girl and which prevailed through my daughter's years here at college still apply to my little granddaughter in grade R. That to me is what makes a college girl and it's just wonderful to have her here as part of the tapestry of the school. We are Galleon girls to the core. College is a school that has stood the test of time. Working at Durban Girls College has been one of the greatest joys of my life. Um, working with um, kind, supportive and really professional women um, who, who aren't afraid to stand with you in, in, in times of hardship and in times of joy and really celebrating one another and supporting and uplifting each other. This is really a great place to work. I'm happy to be here every single day. It has afforded me the ability to raise um, confident, hardworking and, and socially aware young women who are going to be game changers in the world. Global citizens who are, who, who are confident enough and not afraid to challenge social injustice and, and to stand out and stand up for what they believe in. My role as an Inchip Mentor is to be a big sister to the younger girls and it allows me as a high school girl to get to know my little sisters. I think on our journey on the Galleon it's very important to have this connection. And my first word would be growth, um, second would be happy and the last one would be empowering. I like playing in the windy house and I like playing on the jungle jam playing with my friends. I, I like playing with my friends and listening to Miss Granger and chasing on my number sense book. And I like swimming underwater and I'm with all of my friends. 
Mary comes to give us letters and she helps us to, to read. It comes to us and gives us letters when we're good. And she gives us stickers when we when we very good. Well, my first dictionary I want you to say is piano. Then it is tennis. And then it is rhythmic gym. And when you swim, especially when it's hot, I quite enjoy it. It's quite nice. My favorite sport is tennis because you can do it for the rest of your life. And you can do it with all your friends. We have so much fun in creative day, it's my favourite day of the week, we have no homework and we do baking sometimes and we go on the iPads and math and thinking maths and art. I think it's all about team bonding, we like to bake, we work on iPads, we do some art and we have fun. It's uh, the aftercare programme which both my kids are in at the moment. They are well fed, which is very important to parents. They are well taken care of. They get assistance with their homework in aftercare itself. They are happy playing around, getting the exercise they need, which children need to do. There's the standard uh, that is so high set here for sporting uh, events for girls themselves, which is the hockey, the tennis, um, the badminton, the ballet, uh, then the music, the marimbas, the, the recorder, the violin. Uh, the opportunities are, are endless. Rites of passage are a very important part of the lives of our JP girls. In grade R, they get their teddy bear at the end of the year and they celebrate with a teddy bear's picnic that they share with their parents. In grade one, the most important event is the receiving of their white Panama hats, which we do in public with their parents present, and I have the honor of placing those hats on their heads. My answer is everything. DGT is one of very few schools nationally that offer grade double zero to matric with everything all on one property. For those of you who have been on a school, school tour, will see that this is a girl's and a parent's dream. The world-class facilities in the classrooms and learning centers, with the up-to-date technology, the cultural and music departments, to the sports offerings, as well as the extra options, is nothing short of unbelievable. And they are never too young to start either. From the qualified, loving teachers to the sports coaches, the girls get the attention to learn and grow each and every day. For those who have not had the opportunity to walk around, please do. You will be blown away at what DGC has to offer you as a parent, as well as your daughters. The foundations of, of everyone's life is the most important phase. It is the pillar of strength for later on in life, and one could not get a stronger foundation than here in the junior primary at DGC. It is not often you see the headmistress standing in a parking lot greeting and assisting the girls and parents on just an average morning like Mrs. Conradi does. The passion and love that sparkles down from the top is so heartwarming and encouraging for us as parents knowing and witnessing that they are truly loved and cared for each and every day. The fact that some of the teachers are old girls also says a lot. The girls are taught how to think. It's all about the forward thinking. The school is constantly striving to keep up to date with the international trends of education. As the motto goes, our focus is on developing the whole person, producing confident and balanced young girls. And this is true to their statement. Step into this light for just a moment and experience the full joy of what Durban Girls College has to offer your daughter.